of them's got a PhD, but who knows better than Bubby? It's two Bubbies translating science. Today, us Bubbies are going to translate neuroscience. And to kick things off, let's go over to the scientist. Researchers at the Hebrew University have discovered that vision is not a prerequisite for visual cortical regions of the brain to be activated. Over to you, Bubbies. We don't necessarily need our eyes to see things. Boy, my eyesight is already starting to go. I thought that that lamp was a dog. <laughs> Let's see what Mr. Smarty Pants Scientist has to say. Using sensory substitution devices, researchers have been able to take information from one sense and have another sense process the information. It's like if you could touch things with your eyes. Or maybe taste things with your ears. Mmm, steak. Delicious. <laughs> Researchers at the university are testing technology that turns a camera's visual data into a soundscape that helps visually impaired individuals navigate the world around them. Technology that helps the visually impaired to see through music. How poetic. Hey, I got a poem for you. Roses are red, violets are blue. Support their neuroscience research. We're puppies. Our poems don't have to rhyme. Okay.